Today, I'm going to show you how to convert a virtual machine from Oracle VirtualBox to VMware Workstation. Here's my Oracle VirtualBox VM, running Windows Server 2022. First step. Power off the virtual machine to begin the export process. With the VM powered off, go to the top left and click on File. Then choose Export Appliance. Next, select the virtual machine you want to export and hit Next. In the Format settings, choose Open Virtualization Format 1.0. Now, let's set the save path for the .ova file. I'll be saving this to my desktop and naming it Windows Server 2022. Leave the MAC address policy as default and skip any other changes. Now click Next. Click Finish to start the conversion process. This will take a few minutes, so let's wait for it to complete. Now that it's done, you can see the Windows Server 2022.ova file saved on the desktop. Now, let's open this file in VMware Workstation Pro. In VMware Workstation, go to File and then Open. Select the OVA file from the desktop and click Open. Here, you can rename the VM and choose a save location. I'll name it Windows Server 2022 and create a new folder on the desktop for the VM files. Click Import to start the process. If you get a message like this, just click Retry. The import process has started. Wait for it to complete. Once done, you'll see the new VM in your VMware workstation. Before starting the VM, right-click on it and select Edit Settings. Under CDDVD, remove any existing drive. Then add a new one if required. Click OK when done. Now, you can power on this converted VM without any issues. Before using the VM, we recommend installing VMware tools to ensure full functionality and performance. You've successfully converted your VirtualBox VM to VMware Workstation. Thanks for watching.